Rocket League have done it again. They've released an insane painted black market. Drop a like on this video. Let me know down in the comments if you managed to pick it up. Today, I'm going to be showcasing the brand new painted hellfire. Please do subscribe as well to join the Pixel Army. We're well on the way to 910,000 subscribers. Make sure to join the Pixel Army Discord service. You can get involved with blind trading, pick a clip, and all that sort of stuff. I really would appreciate it. Today, we're going to take a break from voice chat. I've been doing a bit of it over on stream and a bit of it in that video that you saw. I will be doing more voice chat videos. I've got loads of ideas about that today. I'm going back into ranked 1v1. Last time we made a video on this, we came up against a Smurf account and they actually forfeited in the end after absolutely destroying us. So that was nice. We'll see how it goes. And when I finally do score, assuming I do, we see the purple painted hellfire. Champ 2 Division 2, like I said, largely helped by the forfeit from the Smurf that was, I think, maybe two or three goals ahead of us. But that just flattered me, to be honest. He was considerably better than me and he for the last two minutes, didn't score unless he was trying to hit a clip. So uh, he was way better than me, and he was called Road to C1, and then he forfeited, hence getting him down to C1. So uh, you're welcome for that, by the way. I hope you haven't ruined too many people's days. But we're going to play 1v1, see how we do. It's been a while. Haven't played one since that video. Maybe it'll be good for us. Through the wasteland, through the highways. What a song that was. On and on. That is Rocket League 2017. That's just YouTube 2017, isn't it? On and on. If you guys know that non-copyright song, then uh, you're a legend. We've got a Signet player joining. It's going to be Spirit Fate, 14 MMR above me. Now, you might you might think that's not a lot, but that's an entire two games. And unless they're on a mad win streak, they're probably, they've been consistently sitting around that level for a good while, which is qu a considerable amount higher than my consistent level of about 1,020 MMR. So... He's probably a solid C2 player, and I am not a solid C2 player. It's weird, I used to be a Grand Champ 1v1 player, but then I just stopped playing it. I think when you hit Grand Champ and you're so far away from SSL, the desire to keep grinding ones is pretty low. And then I think I got reset into Champ 1 one time, and it was just peak for the pick. So uh, I was like, I'm not playing ones again. But now, I am making myself do it, and suffering the consequences, really. Blood pressure, all that. All that comes with playing ones voluntarily for other people's entertainment is uh, what I've decided to basically do to myself. Ah, uh, don't score. Oh, if he scores, I'm a real mug. Oh, okay, okay. I got away with one there. I was really... <laughs> that was close. Let's take a touch. Can we squeeze it in? No, that's a goal for him. The bump he got was just sublime. Okay, he maybe won't be able to convert that. Bang, and we can get our corner boost too. Okay, so... We've been lucky, to be honest. Oh, yes, yes, we managed to catch him sleeping. There it is, the purple hellfire. Oh my goodness, I went so hard in a bump there. Missed him, but the ball just clipped us on the way through. I stayed there, got a touch, got it round him. This is going to be, look at that. I mean, he's had no shots on goal, just been nonstop saving, but he's had the chance to do a couple of counter attacks that I have basically managed to somehow get out of. Oh, no. Oh, God. He thought I was going to bump him. Bang! Okay, I'm kind of chimping right now, which is uh, a term for ball chasing, if you didn't know. So if someone in Rocket League calls you a chimp, they probably mean you ball chase a lot, and they're probably annoyed at you. Oh, it's again, I'm doing it. I don't know why. Look at the recovery. It's so slow. I think that's mechanical. I think I just don't air roll well. <laughs> I'm going to chimp again. <laughs> oh, eventually that's going to get me in trouble. Bang! Let's go, baby! Come on! It was a good read. I had no, I was not certain where he was for this demo. But in the end, bang! Ah, God, it brings out the animal in me. I can't wait to throw this lead and then get annoyed. But he hasn't had a shot on goal yet. And I still feel like I've given up multiple chances to be uh, scored on. Here's one. Just get back. Make yourself big. He's going to get the corner boost. I've got a little pad. Bang, pinch. Oh, I tried to pinch it off him and into his goal. But again, I got away with that. He beat me on the kickoff. Demo here, I reckon. Again? Why? Has he missed? He's missed. He's missed! Oh! Oh, that was a weird noise. Let's not do that again. Pinch. I don't know why I'm giving him so many chances to get back into the game. He's probably so annoyed that he hasn't scored. He should have done by now. I missed the boost pad trying to look at the scoreboard. Okay, that was a good demo. I'm going to take his boost. Get all the way back. He's on the other side. Chip. Flick. Oh, he's got a demo. Okay, I need to be very careful here. I've been given a million and one lifelines. I'm going to shadow this one. See, he flicked in. I mean, that's just lucky. 
There's literally nothing I can do about that. That's just pure luck. Look at this. Look at this. I block the ball. And he just falls into it. He doesn't flip into it. He doesn't purposely land there to think, let me get a dunk off his dunk. He literally just falls on it. And it goes in. So that's unfortunate. Because I think I think shadowing that was the right call. I'm going to make this awkward for him. He's going to make it awkward for me. He might make it too. He knows I've got no boost, but this is fine. Oh, okay. Bang! Oh, it's good play! It's good play from the pick! Goes for the boost. I don't know what he was doing. He was struggling to recover, but I didn't know that. So I had to get that touch there to get it away from him and try and not get demoed. I did not know he was flailing around on the wall like that. We have two minutes and a two-goal lead. So I don't know why I'm nervous because we've, we've given up one goal in three minutes of gameplay. But something can happen psychologically when time is running down like this. Oosh. Oh, God. That's poor from me. That's poor from me again. Not... Not bad from him. Definitely not great from him. It's just it's just all me. I've given it to him. That was such a weak shot that my aerial just did absolutely nothing. Whereas if, if he put a bit more power on it, which he didn't have to, obviously, it would have hit my car and kind of ricocheted off to the corner. But because I had to generate the power myself and I suck, uh, we struggled. This is going to be a challenge as well. I can get this boost. There we go. Ah, I needed a little tap there. Bounce shot. Missed the... Missed the goal. Got to stay on my toes here. He's up in the air. Oh, it's good. It's going to bounce. Oh, hello. Get it to his corner. Mostly because I wasn't going to be able to score. Because that bounce out from the corner was absolutely ludicrous, by the way. Time to chimp. Good demo. Lucky demo, I will say that. But it's either him or the ball we hit there. And the ball would have been a goal for us. I knew he was going to do that, man. I just didn't want to get demoed by him. I had a feeling I'd spawn in that corner as well. Oh, those are the ones like his first goal where you just want to go in. We got the boost. No, I missed. Chat for his bump. No. Good recovery from us there. Really good recovery from us there. Is that... Oh, I thought... He... No way! Look at that. Look at that. Been better all game and we're drawing. How? I did not think he had that in him. I did not think he had that in him. That is very, very frustrating there. I thought I could go up and get the aerial and put it in. And now we're looking like we're going to struggle. He's got the momentum. It's going to have to be demo plays. Oh, no. Counter attack. Here we go. This is it. Bang. Confidence. I knew as soon as he... Let me look at the replay. What was it that he did that made me sure he was going to score? He committed there. I don't know if I bumped him or if he jumped, but I'll take that. Now... I'm going to work really hard to try and hold on to this lead, bro. Come on. Oosh. Yes! Yes! No! Oh, what a save. No way. No way. I'm giving him too much space here. Oh, it's a good, it's a good challenge. Good challenge. Watch out for a demo. Yep. Fake challenge. Fake challenge. Yes! Come on, baby! And it would have been 5-3. Come on! What a game! He's not going to say anything. He's going to leave. Plus 10 MMR. We are firmly out of the cesspool that is C1. And deservedly so. I think I got away with a lot in the first two minutes. But in the last half of the game, I think he was quite fortunate with the way he got back into it. So I think 4-3 is probably a fair result. I'll take that. Purple Hellfire. Bang. And that means I haven't lost a ranked 1v1 game since voice chat has come into the game. So maybe voice chat helps ranked. <laughs> to be fair, I have only played whilst recording. And that is like having voice chat with someone because I sort of talk to myself as well as talking to you. So we'll play one more. Maybe I'll just show you the highlights of it. I'll really sweat because if we can get another video with two out of two wins, that's a lot of progression. Whereas win one, lose one, you stay the same, right? This would be a lot of progression to get four out of four wins in two videos. Wouldn't be displeased with three out of four, to be fair. So... It's a win-win either way for me. I think we might have a drop to open, actually. So I think I could open that. Then we'll play the game. Let's see what we've got here. As you may know, my drop luck's been pretty good lately. I don't know if that's a boost, if I heard that correctly. Or... Yeah, it is. Damn it. Okay. Ranked once. Here we go. Octane Reviver. It's a pretty cool decal. Looked kind of rocket passy, But here we go. Urban Central. It's not the same guy. And it's a guy that had the similar MMR to what I had earlier. So I'm going to sweat it out. 
and see how it goes. I've been getting better at my kickoffs, you know. Maybe not better at my kickoffs, but better at not losing them. It's a really good 50. It's a really good 50. Really good 50 from him. And he's got either a white or a gray tenter goal. Look at this 50. How does he turn and get a 50 like that? Disgusting. Bounce shot inbound. Good shot. Good save. Rocket League's the winner there. Put it around the right side. It's another good 50 from him. Get this boost. I, was I let him do that. I just was confident I could then hit the ball away. He thinks I've got nothing. Bang! Oh, it's really good shadow defense. This guy's a smart player. I would have thought he'd think, yeah, he's got a little boost. I'm going to just let him... I'm just going to dive in and, and score. But instead, he waited for me and just did that. Fair play. I'll give him a nice one for that. That was a good one. And we have a chat back, finally. Things you love to see. Pinch. Yeah. That was very risky from him, but that's a very much... That's very much a, I'm two goals up, I'm going to try it. And if I can get three goals up with it, great. Sort of move. Very risky. <laughs> Good kickoff. Great bump. That was a really nice bump. Come on. Come on. Again, I didn't know too much about where he went after I bumped him. But we managed to get the goal. That was good. Back in the game, baby. I think at this stage, you'd rather be me, you know? I haven't missed a single shot, and I've scored the last two goals. That's another one. I definitely think you'd rather be me in this scenario. Really good flick. I'm going to keep trying to play smart. There's a long time left to go in this game, and I do think this guy's quite an intelligent player. The way he scored his second goal showed me that. Whereas the guy last game just showed me that I think I was the more intelligent player, but this one I'm not so sure. He gets good 50s as well. Sign of a, an experienced ones player. I'm going to get to the ball first here. I would if I could aerial. 3-3. <laughs> three, three. Time for this boost. I will have to sustain a shot though. You're kidding me. I've saved that on my screen. Literally cleared that on my screen. Lamau. Like, nice bump. What the heck? That's not what happened. Two different strategies there. I went all in on the flick. He foregoed, foregone. He forsaken. He decided not to flick and went for the demo instead. He foregone, forewent the flick. Yeah, there we go. He deserved that. <laughs> People can't resist. I shouldn't have hit it that hard. People cannot resist flip resets in this game. When they have the chance to get one. Yes! Yes! He's got the angle! That's all because he went for a flip reset and put himself on the back foot. See, you won't catch me doing that in ones. I do that with double taps and ceiling shots. Because I'm more likely to score a double tap or a ceiling shot than a flip reset. Flip reset is a once in a blue moon type thing. Yes, baby! Let's go! The bump! The bump! Couldn't even see him. Just flattened him. Get it on target. Get it high. And then mess him up. Don't even need a demo. Keep him round. Keep him round to watch it go in. All right. Let's keep playing smart. Keep making these saves. Win kickoffs and watch out for the bumps. If we do that, we win the game. Get a few demos in here. Here and there. That was ludicrous. That was ludicrous. Oh my. What a... What a goal that would have been. The wave dash pinch. Bro, that might be, even though it didn't go in, which sounds weird, one of the best 1v1 goals I've ever scored. Now, if you don't play Rocket League at all, you're probably looking at that going, why is he getting so gassed? But everything about that, the way I drew him in and the mechanics to hit the ball like that, I've impressed myself. And I think that's why he forfeited. I think that was unbelievable. We've done it. That is going to do it for this video. Please do drop a like. Subscribe down below to join the Pixel Army. If you wonder why I'm a little bit red and kind of... I've got more color to me. I'm, I've actually been out in the sun. Uh, so, yeah. It, summer's here. I'm happy. I hope you are as well. I'll see you in the next video very soon.